Hello friends, today I will explore newly introduced Canva Pro's Magic Studio. Magic Studio has many features like Magic Expand, Magic Edit, Magic Eraser and a lot more. So without wasting time, let's start exploring Magic Studio. I will start by creating a blank canvas. It can be any size, I am gonna choose banner. So let's search for picture to use for our edits. For that I will go to elements and look for woman picture. Let's go to photos and choose a picture and bring it to our canvas. Next go to edit image. Here you can see all the tools from Magic Studio. I will first use BG Remover. Now choose a background for it. I will type funky backgrounds in the search box. Choose an image and set it as background. Let's give the image a shadow to make it look more realistic. For this, go to Edit Image, scroll down to Effects, click on Shadows and choose Drop. Adjust Intensity and Blur for the shadow. Now let's make some light adjustments to background to match it with the subject. For this let's go to Adjust and Increase Brightness. This is how we remove and change background in Canva. Now let's add a new page and search for candle and add it on canvas. It can be anything, not just candle. After choosing the image, Go to Edit Image and select Magic Eraser. Choose the brush size and paint over the objects you want to remove. You can see how easily we can remove unwanted objects using Magic Eraser. Let's create a new page and add an image on canvas. I will choose this one and then resize it on the canvas. The next tool we are going to use is Magic Expand. For this, again go to Edit Image and click on Magic Expand. I will select Whole Page and click on Magic Expand. This will make the image expand according to the size of my canvas. This option uses AI technology to create four variations of the expanded pixels, we can choose whatever option suits us. For me, this one works so I will go with it. I love the addition of this option the most. For the next tool, I will choose an image again and then choose the Magic Grab option. It will separate the subjects or any objects in our image from the background. This option is really cool if you want to move the objects or subjects on the same background to another position. For our next option, I will use the same image and this tool is really amazing if you want to separate text from your image. For this again, go to Edit Image and click on Grab Text option. It will automatically detect the text in image and separate it as text. So we can move it around and even edit the text as well. This option is really cool when you want to get the text from an image, it will save you time writing texts from image. Our last but not least Magic Studio option is Magic Edit. I will start by adding an image to the canvas and use Magic Expand to make it the size of canvas and you can see how amazing results we get using this tool. Next, I will choose Magic Edit option. This option allows us add any object to the area we will paint over. So let's adjust the size of the brush. 
painted over to the area. We can use AI prompts to create the objects we can add on the brushed area. I will use this prompt example given by Canva and see what it comes up with. You can see, it came up with really good options. I will choose this one. So this is the overview of the Magic Studio by Canva. All these tools are really amazing and can help a lot in increasing the speed of your design workflow. If you liked this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel.